BitPainter is a painting robot that paints with a brush on canvas. It can work from a photo, but it doesn't really have to. It just paints. I came up with the idea because I'm a painter, and as my family grew, I found myself having less and less time to paint. I needed an assistant, something to help me paint faster and better. And I thought if it could do the first seven hours of work and just leave me the last fun, interesting, creative one hour, I would be set. And so about 10 years ago, I set about building uh, the first of what has now become five different painting robots. It's a combination of art, technology, software, everything from color theory to mathematics, even a little calculus. Anything and everything that I've learned over the years, I just pour into this. Someone might say, I want to have a portrait made. So a portrait will be loaded into its memory, and it compares the blank canvas to what it needs to paint. And then it randomly picks a spot on the canvas and says, I'm going to make this spot look more like the image that I'm trying to paint. And it'll keep on repeating this over and over again. It'll eventually arrive at a point where it can no longer make the canvas look like the image. And that's when it's done its best. I've had some friends joke with me that it's an over-engineered printer. And uh, it is an over-engineered printer in much that it prints with a paintbrush. It paints from a lot of different colors. The big difference is that where printers print exactly what you give it, BitPainter does a lot of its own decisions. It also takes inputs from humans. The image is always live, it's always changing. Printers finish printouts in a couple seconds. BitPainter will take days to finish a painting. Some of the best feedback I get is from my kids because typically anything a parent does is boring, geeky, uninteresting, but this they actually think is really cool. There's a lot of different motivations for this. One is just to make better and better paintings and, and to learn more about how I paint, just learn more about my creative process. And a motivation for doing that is to try and get a computer to be as creative as I am.